All right, so this is Milo 2023.0, and for this version, we've uh, done some major work under the hood and upgraded from Unreal Engine version 4 to Unreal Engine version 5. So Unreal Engine is the uh, game engine which is uh, running the real-time rendering. So that's going to allow for a lot of uh, new possibilities. Um, one of the things you can see here with this model um, is that we've updated the color rooms so that global illumination is uh, being cast from the room itself. So if I change the background color here, uh, you'll see that on the faucet, the light being reflected up onto the faucet from the floor is changing. Um, so that makes models look much more grounded in this environment uh, and is just a nicer look overall. Uh, we've also added two new lighting rigs that are soft lighting rigs. Uh, ring light, which is sort of a directional soft, soft lighting. Uh, you can see how soft the shadows are. Um, especially, this is especially works with uh, ray tracing enabled, which is what we have here. Um, and the other one is light box, which will evenly light it from all sides. So you can still move it around and get slight differences, but it's casting light from all sides at once to uh, make your model look as though it were sitting inside of a light box. And then over here in the sky background, we've updated the volumetric clouds, so they're rendering at a much higher fidelity and resolution. Um, and updating much more quickly when you remix them. So that should be fun to play with as well. And that's it. Those are our changes for 2020, Milo 2023.0. You can download it at nevercenter.com slash silo because Milo comes free when you buy silo. And uh, take a look and let us know what you think. And thanks for watching.